Yeah, hello YouTube. KG2LI here. Just showing you how easy it is to get on the air. If you're listening to uh, N4DW. He's in Florida. I just contacted him minutes ago. We're on 5 watts here. You're looking at a radio that transmits 5 watts maximum. We're obviously running CW or Morse code. Back out a little bit. There's my key. It's a junker. Or Yunker, it's pronounced Yunker though, it's spelled J-U-N-K-E-R. Ugly looking thing, but man does it send. It's a beautiful key, I love it. Uh, we'll look over here at our power source. We're running off of an Odyssey uh, SLA battery, sealed lead acid battery. This is an AGM battery, absorbed glass mat. Really great batteries, that's about nine years old and uh, still got a lot of life left in it, it's amazing. Here we have an inline watt meter that tells us we're at a uh, 12.32 volts on the battery remaining we're down 3.98 amp hours about 4 amp hours 4 amp hours used up out of a 16 amp hour battery I've been on the air I've had the radio on the air for about uh, 12 hours now draws about 300 milliamps on receive so we're good for another two days on that on that on a charge with that thing it's just amazing we'll take a little cruise over here to my windowsill where I have a inexpensive antenna tuner, an SWR meter, and on the back of the antenna tuner we got a little BNC to banana jack adapter there. That white wire goes out my window and connects to the rain gutter. Yeah, the rain gutter on the front of the condo. Purple wire is a counterpoise that goes out the window and goes around uh, 15 feet along the outside of the building. And that's all it takes to get on the air and uh, do this. Let's see if we can get a look at my log here so far. This is inside of about 15 minutes. And for OX, he was in uh, Florida. We got Florida here, Georgia, Illinois, Texas, Michigan, and Tennessee. He's the last guy I worked. That's the one you're listening to now in the background, N4DW. He's calling CQ test, which means contest. And then he's saying his call sign, N4DW. He gave me a signal strength of 599, which means he heard me pretty strong. That 599 refers to the uh, signal. See, you see it says S9 there. That's his signal strength, S9. You'll see it come up again. He's at S8 now. He varies between S8 and S9. And I actually have the attenuator on, so he's booming in here. He's coming in here real strong. That's all it takes to get on the air. We're inside my little condo here. If I get bored working with radio, i got my uh, little Android sitting there. I don't think it's going to focus, but I'm on Astronomy Caster. That's an awesome web page. If you're into astronomy at all, you got to check them out. They're up to episode 306 now, and I started listening to them around 200. But everything's archived, so I, I can do my catching up, going through their server there, and listening right from the beginning. Great web page. We'll back up a little bit here to show you where I'm actually operating from. This is all it takes. That's my ham radio shack there. A little credenza under a window with my battery. That battery is usually on the floor just for video purposes. I put it up there so I could show everything that I use to get on the air. And if I get tired, there's my bed. Yeah, I live in a little studio condo. So don't think you need a big house and a uh, lot of trees to throw wires in the antenna or a 500 foot tower. This is all it takes to get on the air. This is all it takes right there. I'm going to zoom in a little bit again. This uh, little funny looking thing sticking out of my radio here. This is an adapter. There's an antenna connector on the back and also one in the front. And the one in the front I switch to for when I'm out in the field. And uh, I just put a quarter wave wire on each one of these. So on like 40 meters or 7 megahertz. 33 foot hunk of wire there going up a tree. Another 33 foot hunk of wire attached here running along the ground as a counterpoise. And, and I'm on the air on a 40 meter band uh, ready to have some fun. So this is all it takes to get on the air and do all kinds of fun stuff. Doesn't take much, 5 watts. I failed once. There was one guy I called that couldn't hear me. He was in Alaska on 10 meters. It's the only failure so far. I've worked everyone I've heard. Everyone I, can, I hear can hear me and I usually get them on a first shot with 5 watts. Imagine that. Okay, that's all I got for you now. KG Radio is clear and uh, have some fun.